what's up beauties it's your girl pianist beauty and welcome back to my channel you are here at the right place because in this channel we talk about beauty fitness lifestyle hairstyle and of course fashion so today we're going to be talking about stretch max and trust your girl she's been through hell in the hands of stretch max our a little disclaimer i'm no doctor i'm only talking out of my experience and it's experience that is ev evident to anybody who knows me so before we get into the video if you haven't subscribed please go ahead and subscribe and support your girl if you don't know where the subscription button is and all my videos i have a purple icon just below the, the video that's where you can subscribe or you subscribe on the red button without much ado let's just get into the topic of today so stretch mark is um it's common with many women like out of 10 you um, have just about two people who don't have stretch marks so it's very common among women and that is why i want to talk about it and I ha i've had a few subscribers who requested this video uh, before i really talk about it i just want to give you a little a little story about myself in 2013 i had my first baby and she's a beautiful her name is blender when i had her i was weighing 90 kg and before i was weighing 54 kg imagine from 54 to 90 kg it's expected for a woman who is pregnant and all that so plus it was my first baby after i had her i had a lot of stretch marks and i think the stretch marks came along because of the way i lost weight i lost weight so rapidly before she turned seven months if you see me i was in the university you wouldn't know i have a baby honestly everybody was asking me how did you do it i just guess it's the it was the busy lifestyle i was living back then so i had a lot of stretch marks and when i came back home my mom recommended um castor oil i don't know if uh, you, you know about it but i that's my go-to so she recommended castor oil which i used for a while and i discovered that the stretch marks were fading away after a few months i didn't have stretch marks at all honestly i'm just telling you i didn't have stretch marks it was so miraculous that Many people were asking me, what do you do? Because I love swimming. I usually go to the pool to swim back home. That's how I got rid of my stress marks. It wouldn't be fair for me to come here and I'm lying. It, it, doesn't, it doesn't speak well of me. So whatever thing I tell you on this channel, there are things I've tried out. I don't just make videos because I want to make them. There are lots of topics I can talk about. But because I haven't experienced them and I haven't tried them out, I will not talk about them. I want to be honest. I want to be as honest as possible in this channel. So when I came to Ireland, I had my second baby, that was one year ago. I didn't have no organic castor oil. But throughout my pregnancy, what I was using was bow oil. This oil doesn't take away the, the stretch marks, but it, um, it fades it away. The thick lines will still be there, but it will not be as visible as not using this at all so you can see it's almost gone i use this throughout my pregnancy because i didn't have organic castle oil i know the cells i'm in shops but <laughs> the one i really trust is the one i know is unrefined it's not processed nothing nothing that's the one i trust so much so i was using bow oil and um, i think about six months ago my mom sent me castor oil this is what i have here this is the castor oil sent to me from africa if you're in africa if you're in cameroon get yourself castor oil it's very good it's good for the hair it's good for in fact today we're focusing on stretch marks so let me just stay uh, on the topic stretch marks so i will not um I will not come here and I'll be like, oh, this company sent me this and I used it for one week and my stretch marks went away. No, sis, I'm not going to lie to you. 
it takes time it takes consistency and it takes commitment to see those stretch marks gone you have to you have to keep moisturizing your body daily if possible twice a day now there is a, a recipe you can do to speed up the process which i i think for my first pregnancy i did that for a while i saw changes but i was lazy to continue what you do is that you take this castor oil and you mix it up with aloe vera aloe vera is very good for the skin it rejuvenates the skin so when you mix it up with this castor oil in lesser time your stretch marks will be gone when you keep using it you will see that they're fading away and fading away that is what you want you want the stretch marks to fade away and eventually they will go away you can also use um shea butter this is shea butter or refined organic shea shea butter you can use this with the castor oil and aloe vera it would so much speed the process when this when this castor oil was sent to me i melted some of this um shea moisture shea butter sorry i melted some of this shea butter and mixed it with this one we don't have aloe, i don't have aloe vera we don't have aloe vera around it comes in shop once a while but i've never been opportunity to get get one so i just mix up these two and i use on my stomach every blessed day and i bet you the stretch marks are gone i'm very proud because considering how much i weighed when i had my baby i weighed 120 kg i feel like crying i feel like crying but it's the truth i'm going to leave a picture right here so you can see what i'm talking about i will not i will not lie to you i will, honestly i don't know how much i can convince you about this remedy i will not lie to you i was very fat many people told me that vivian you won't go back to your normal size i'm not yet i'm a normal size but i'm so proud of how far i've come presently i weigh 75 from 120 kg to 75 kg it's it's no joking matter you need to give me a hand of happiness and my baby is one year old to crown it all so as i was saying you use if you don't have castor oil use shea, shea butter if you don't have shea butter you can just use aloe vera if you have aloe vera you can use any essential oil you can use almond oil but the best the best that worked for me is castor oil if you can lay your hands on castor oil then that will be perfect if you can lay your hands on organic castor oil you can go to pharmacies and buy the castor oils that they sell there it's better than nothing and make sure that you are persistent in this remedy rub it on your stomach every day if your stretch marks are so terrible you want to rub it in the morning and in the evening and with consistency and patience you're going to see a difference honestly you are really going to see a difference Please, I'm going to show you a remedy, a homemade remedy you can do to fade out your stretch marks and get rid of your stretch marks. If you don't have castor oil nor um, shea butter at home nor aloe vera, you can use this homemade remedy and it's going to help a lot. Before my, uh, my castor oil arrived, I came across this remedy and I was using it before the castor oil came. Even if you have castor oil, you can combine this for a speedy result. Now let's just get into the tutorial. Limes help to lighten up the skin and as such, rubbing them on the affected areas will help lighten up and fade out those stretch marks. And secondly, almond oil contains vitamin E which promotes the growth of new skin cells as these new skin cells are growing up that's how the stretch marks will be fading out you can use any other essential oil of your choice you can use coconut oil or raspberry oil or even olive oil any one you can lay hands on but with the combination of these other two ingredients it's going to hasten up the fading of those scars and moving on to sh brown sugar you can use white sugar sugar is very important because it softens the skin and it helps to lock in the moisture so it locks in the 
almond oil or any other oil you have to that skin which eventually helps in fading out your scars please guys you have to do this consistently you can you can prep this remedy in such a way that it can take you for two weeks or any amount it doesn't matter the amount of time you keep it that's why i'm not using a measurer i'm just putting in the ingredients you can do things and use it for about two weeks i like doing a weekly supply so i'm gonna use this for one week and you can use this while pregnant or after or even if you don't have a baby you can still use this this remedy is very very good please do let me know on the comment section how it goes for you which all you have let's chat out guys this is what we have you just have to rub it into the affected areas wherever you have stretch man just rub it in make sure that it is well dissolved into your skin do this morning and evening every day for a faster results that's it for today guys thank you so much for sticking with me to the end if you haven't subscribed please go ahead and subscribe i love to see your comments comment on whatever thing you want me to talk about this was the recent video and i did it whatever thing you have i'm gonna take about it and um do well to share this video your comments and your likes do help me a lot it helps others to see this video so if you don't comment and you don't like others from not see if you haven't subscribed please subscribe and by god's grace i'm going to see you in my next love you so much bye